Uh, what do I spend six f nodes on? Uh, line gun, get that other damage upgrade. Yeah. And then... Contact beam. You can upgrade the cap and get that uh, last SFD. And reload speed. Nice Finally. even 20. <laughs> Finally! <laughs> uh. Um, what are these? Projectiles? That's projectile speed. Yeah. Why not, I guess. Alright. One last chance to save. Hell yeah. What's my inventory? And I've used so many line racks. <laughs> now that I've got the, the trip laser trip wires so kitted out. There. Six more line racks. Alright. Since they are so useful now. I don't think I ever used anything but the plasma cutter on the hive mind, but that was in the original game. Because usually, by the, in the original game, by this time... Oh yeah, there it is. 15 hours. Yeah. Not 18 hours, it's 15. Um, by this time in the, ga in the original game, the plasma cutter is, if you've upgraded it, the best oh, weapon in the game. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, yeah, there's some shit. rocks falling. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Last warning, Isaac. I mean it. Shit. I don't understand why we cannot both leave. Like, Daniels, Cause, please. Because she's why trying to bury everything, and you're not... Gonna stay quiet? Exactly. I could be paid. Oh! oh. I could be paid. Still trying you know. to save her. Oh! Oh! Weird. Oh my god, there's so many pickups. Holy shit. You dropped your gun. Uh, it's encircling me, and I don't like that. Oh boy. <laughs> we now know what this thing actually is. Yeah. This is a proto brethren moon. Yeah, it's. Thank you, objectives. Oh. Ooh, nice shot. It's just thrashing so much. Can you stasis it? I don't think I've ever tried. No. no. <laughs> Come on, stop. Thanks for smashing me, by the way. Oh, right in the eyeball. Why is it giving you an oxygen tank? Blue at random blue tables. Holy shit. I don't know if those like explode or what. I think they explode. Bitch. They're flat. Yeah, they explode. Isaac ain't got time for your shit. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Ooh, you meant that. Thanks.
I love how Isaac is just like, at this point, you know what? Fuck you. It's how he is at the end of every dead space. He's just like, you want some? Fine. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Oh, acid. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, loser. I'm coming. Show me your tummy. Come on. Uh. Ah, fuck. You can only get one at a time. <laughs> Just gonna throw a piece of metal at him. Oh! Okay. Gotcha. And this one's on an angle. Okay. Boom! I think he's angry at you, Kina. Yeah. Come on, you need to take a breath after that? Ah, all right. Oh, ow. Not all right anymore. There you go. All right, he's opening up. <laughs> you motherfucker. I'm an engineer. I solve problems. I have and a portable right now... particle accelerator. What do you want? What are you going to do? Huh? <laughs> Right now, you're a problem, so I'm gonna solve it. I can't Ooh. tell where it's going. It's using the right one. It's using the left one. It's using the right one. And he's opening up. Oh, you feeling a little ho? Oh, oh shit, I forgot about this part. <laughs> I did not forget about this part. Kill it. Kill it I'm before it eats now. you. I'm, I'm trying, Dave. Hang on. I'm, I'm trying. I, it's a... Ow, ow, ow. Whoa! Oh, uh, ow. Oh. Oh. oh, fuck. Ow. He's not done yet, or... No, I think that was the last phase. Yep. Oh! Get away from me, you disgusting monstrosity. Quick, go check on Daniel's body. <laughs> Never mind. She got pulped. Yeah, she's gone. Like, super dead. <laughs> Ow. Damn it. Yeah, he's a little tired. Fucking open the door. Ugh. That hysterical strength. Just <laughs> pulling the door open. That's, that's adrenaline and exhaustion all in the same... Fuck you, Marker. I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh, too much G. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, that's moving oh. very fast. Oh. 
do not look directly at the nuclear explosion. <laughs> no kidding. Whoa, what are you doing? Huh? I didn't do anything. Uh, hit escape. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> <sighs> Dead space okay. completed. Okay, everything's fine now. Okay. Uh, let's just take this off for a little bit. Okay. Oh, he's so oh, sweaty. Oh, God, he looks terrible. Yeah. Now, if this was a certain other game, like, an entire, like, actual literal river of sweat would have poured out from underneath that <laughs> helmet <laughs> as soon as it got broken. I'm sorry. Just... No, just no, not okay. I wish I was still still. And yeah. that's the end. They kept that in. They kept that in. Yep. There is. A new a ending. There is a second ending, yes. There do you is know a what secret it is? Ending. Yes, I do. Okay, so, for everybody out there, because you have to play through the entire game on New Game Plus, and you get a, an additional side quest, which is to collect 12 marker symbols scattered about the ship. Once you collect all of those and you get to the end of the game, he gets on the ship, and he turns and he sees her, but she doesn't look dead. She looks alive, and he goes, he says something to the effect of, don't worry, I'm going to build something that's going to make this all better. And he gets all the crazy marker symbols all around him. Yeah, like the, the, you have to collect all the items, all the marker uh, statues, and then complain, you have to all put them in a room together, and yeah. then you do a, like, it, it does a, a ritual, and then... Uh, instead of saying at the end where he has nothing left, he uh, that he has nothing left, yeah. he instead tells the the hive the hive mind that it can't stop him. Yeah. Uh, and then, yeah, the end of the game in that last little scene, he she's uh, alive and walking well quote alive and walking around. Yeah. And then you the th the screen like the view changes a little bit. And every surface on the inside of the ship is covered in uh, marker, marker, yeah. marker writing. Um, and then there's the other thing, which is yeah. clearly they changed this game to make it more in line with what uh, was explained in Dead Space 2. But yeah. um, do you know why uh, the marker was so desperate to be put back on that pedestal? No. Okay. Because the marker wants to create a convergence. Yes. In order for a convergence to happen, the maker has to be absorbed by the marker. Uh. So in the second game, <clears throat> the marker has to absorb Isaac in order to yes. initiate a convergence because he made it. Right. The people that made that marker are all dead. Yes. And therefore cannot be absorbed by it. Hmm. So instead, the marker says, put it back, which is what it said to Nicole. Because if mm. the marker can't do what it's supposed to do, which is initiate a convergence event, it'll wait until the time is right. Which, for that marker, would be <coughs> never. Exactly. <clears throat> exactly. <clears throat> but it also didn't want the hive mind going out of control. Because the hive mind is a proto-brethren moon. It's basically right. a baby. Yes. So the marker is saying, put, it, put me back so I can make sure that it stays calm and sleeping until the time is right. Isn't that messed uh, up? It's pretty <laughs> fucked. Fred Tachiscore. But yeah, this uh, was this was a really good remake. I Yeah, like this is an astoundingly well made remake. Like this is how a remake every any kind of remake should be done to this to this lot like standard. <laughs> well, I mean this is quote unquote the last of the remakes that we're finishing up that we played recently. I did System Shock remake, Resident Evil 4 remake, this remake, 
Um, there was another one. Let me look it up. Hold on a second. Dave, be quiet. Dave, stop. Dave, no. I pick you up and shake you hard. If there's a Dead Space 2 remake, I am play. We are playing it. I shake you harder. We are going to play Dead Space 2, Dave. Was that not a thing? <laughs> Did I say anything about not doing Dead you, Space 2? You, ju you just said that, th that this was the last remake we're doing. No, I said this is the last remake that we finished recently. Oh, okay. That's what you said. Uh, because we did Resident Evil 4. We did... Um, on the channel, not necessarily you and me. Um, no, I didn't do that. We did uh, System Shock remake. Um... I feel like there was another one recently, too. Huh. Yeah, we basically like, did, like, three remakes in the space of all at the same time. Oh. And, god damn it, the remakes are... When they put, like, the love and the care and the attention to detail into them, it's just... Mwah, I love it. I love it yeah. so much. Like, there are, a no there are a bunch of examples of really, really <coughs> well-made remakes, like this one and... The Resident Evil, all of the Resident Evil remakes. Yes. How was the System Shock remake? Was it all right? Was it good? Like, except for the fact that there's so many good games coming out this year, I would have said it was one of my games of the year. Oh. Easily. Yeah, it's System System Shock. Like, there's a bunch of examples that are that you can point to and be like, remakes can be incredible. Like, oh, yeah. they can really and like really breathe new life into a like a franchise. Well, here's the thing about the System Shock remake. Um, after we finished it on the channel, yeah, I, I was like, because normally what I do is when we finish a game on the channel, I go to my Steam library and I uninstall it because my game's drive is only 500 gigabytes and I have so much space. Oh my god, you only have 500? Damn. Um, it's on an M2 drive. It's the biggest I could afford. Um, three days... I have a 2 terabyte M2. Three days after we finished System Shock Remake, I yeah. reinstalled it, turned all the difficulty up, and finished it in four days. Wow. I nice. don't replay games for the most part, and I had to play through that game again. It was Ooh. so good. I've never played any of the System Shock games. Uh, so you should play System Shock Remake, because you'll be surprised by it. Then you should okay. go back and play the original System Shock, but on oh, Enhanced God. Condition. Um, just to see how it's changed. You don't have to play through the whole thing, but you can get it for like 10 bucks. It's not a big deal. And then System Shock it's 2... It's more of a time thing. System Shock 2 is the one that everyone remembers, and I think it's the worst one. Really? Yeah. System okay. Shock 2 is... It's not bad, don't get me wrong. But of the three System Shock games now available, I think it's the worst one. Hmm. <coughs> But yeah, I got I I as much as it pains me to admit it, I do have to give EA props for doing this. They got in yes. they brought in a team that understood the original game. They changed one of the most iconic things, which was that Isaac doesn't talk. And yeah. I will admit that I was first a little leery of that. Right, then, right. Then they brought back the original voice talent that uh, voiced Isaac Gunner Wright, and he again fucking nailed it out of the park, man. Yeah. This this was, like, all the story beats were there, and it still surprised us. And that's not easy to do with a remake, you know? No. <laughs> oh, man. But yes, I'm sorry that this took so long for us to finish, everybody. Uh, there were just a bunch of issues. <laughs> <laughs> Literally just... Technical difficulties in real life. The game. My new computer. Figuring out how to like how to actually fix my new my brand new computer. Uh, to like everyone involved, me and Dave both getting sick. In my case, several like multiple times. The graphics driver is crashing. Succession. The graphics driver bug, <laughs> uh, forcing the game to crash over and over again. I oh, mean. Gosh. It, it, it's <laughs> there's never been a series where it hasn't been a moment of is this really what we're putting up on the channel this this <laughs> shit show and yes <laughs> this is what we're putting up on the channel because technical difficulties yeah. are fun I could 
I could, we always could. The scuff like, is part of the experience. Well, we could always um, edit it out. It wouldn't even be hard. But I feel like that's half the fun seeing that, you know, a professional, quote unquote professional, production can have problems too. It's not about being perfect, everybody. It's about being, it's about having fun. Yeah. I don't know, after eight years, do you think we're professionals? Well, we've been doing this for eight years. 2014, no, almost <laughs> nine. Oh, wow. 2014, Crazy. I think. <clears throat> uh, how many subscribers is the channel up to, Dave? Uh, as of today, 2221. Huh? <laughs> I'm waiting for that mythical moment when it hits 2222. Let's see. Maybe it did it while I wasn't looking. It did! We're at 2222. Thank you, everybody who does subscribe and watch this. Thanks for everybody yeah. who sticks through the credits with us, too, because, you know. Yeah. Listening to us just chatter for no. <clears throat> These people worked on this game. <sighs> we played this game. The least we can These do is support them by saying thank you. This game was fantastic, and if you haven't gotten this game, you should, because it is absolute. I don't like that games are, like, really expensive. They're, like, 80 bucks for me, or some, they're, like, 80 or 90 dollars for me. In Canada, Sometimes yeah. even 100, because it's in Canada. Mm. But, like, I don't regret... This was worth every cent, <laughs> this game. Was worth every penny. Well, actually, wait, no. We don't have pennies anymore. This was worth every dime. <laughs> do you not have nickels either? No. Wait, do I have nickels? <laughs> every nickel. Nickel is five every, cents, dime we is do ten. Have, no, no, we do have nickels. This is worth every nickel. Okay. Fair. Um, yeah, and honestly, so the best thing that I can say about a game is I, well, okay. When it comes to a game's cost versus a game's value, if I got at least one hour of enjoyment out of every five bucks that I spent, I'm good. Did you get at least one, five, uh, one hour of enjoyment out of every five dollars you spent, Kina? Um, well, let's see. We this, we, this playthrough was uh, about 15 and a half hours. Yep. Uh, and that's about $150 worth or yes. so. But remember all the difficulties that we had too. Yeah, but none of those cost anything. Except time. I guess, but <laughs> the time I spent playing this game was enjoyable, and I did enjoy I did enjoy the experience a lot. So yeah, I'd Ooh, say production worth babies. It. Here we go. Oh, oh. fifty thousand oh. creds, ten power nodes, text logs. Oh. oh, it actually gave you a reward for huh. For, uh, for New Game Plus, it gives you a bunch of shit. What text logs were awarded, I wonder? I don't know. New Game Plus. Interesting. Can we look at them really quick by skipping the intro? Maybe. Let's see where this uh, dumps us out. Probably back on the main menu, I would imagine. There it is. Uh, sure, let's very quickly... Yeah. Will carry over weapons, items, credits, and upgrades from your completed playthrough. They can be retrieved from the storage at any of any store you encounter. You can expect to face new enemies and perhaps find new mysteries to uncover. Uh, uh, let's see. Oh, story. Isaac heals automatically. Easy. What? Isaac also you heals automatically, and enemy grappling attacks are much easier to escape. The st this is the game journalist. Difficulty level. <laughs> Look, game journalists got shit to do, all right? <laughs> no, they don't. How many games have come out in the last month alone? Their Gina? job is literally to play the games. Look, pick they a have difficulty. No excuse to be bad at them, Dave. Pick a difficulty uh, and let's go. Let's see if we can get that I text log. So we played it on hard. So yeah. you know what? I'm going to bring it down a little bit. Just for the, I, I'm just honestly to get, just to do this one little bit. I'm honestly surprised you didn't unlock hardcore. Ooh. Hilariously, the whole drop the blast shield thing was a way yeah. that they could uh, in the original game was a way to 
cut out the view through the view screen so that they could then teleport you into the ship. Yeah. That's a, a little, just a little trick that, yeah. to avoid having to do with something. Yeah. Shit. And it's completely, like, in-universe and believable. Yeah. Stabilizer, Isaac. Gotta always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. I love how the Jen, sparks bounce off of you. Calm yeah. Down. We lost poor booster. We've got a fire in one of the stabilizers and... Also, apparently they sampled, like, uh, 40-year-old like heart rates and breathing and exertion just to get his yeah. sounds correct nice they put yeah. in a lot of work because he because he's like 43 ish i think in this something like that <laughs> isaac do you always walk around in so much fucking metal i'm an engineer yes. i am an engineer all right can you bring up your thing oh uh tab my inventory uh, the text oh. logs. Text log. My inventory is empty! Oh no! Indecipherable. Oh. Hold on. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, so indecipherable. You go get help. I'll hold the fort. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That says they walk in white, untouched by red. They order the living. They shepherd the dead. A finger's touch were frozen still. They are the answer. They are the will. Beyond the stars, the brethren wait. Oracles deliver us from humanity's fate. Ooh. Be proud, Jack. Gotta see your one piece. Spooky. Huh. Life on the sprawl. I wouldn't mind something to steady my nerves, especially on CEC stab. Huh. You see anyone in flight control? No. Nobody. Absolutely try for the sprawl on Titan. The mining sounds like cotton candy compared to Age of Seven and where is that they built. At least we didn't take out the sign. Built up the station since the investment came in. Shopping malls, even holy shit. Yeah, holy shit, remember those shopping malls? Yeah, right. CEC sponsors family transfers to the sprawl if your record is in standing, too. I don't know how old yours is, but I, here's a great place. Kelly. Okay. Uh, what else we got? Last will and Last. testament. Octavia Clark of Sound Mind and the site of Altman are prophet. <laughs> oh we'll hear in your document my <laughs> final wishes. All assets to the Church of Unitology... Uh, request upon my I'm death by physical... Shut up. I ordered no. that my, any previous will and testament be declared null and void in perpetuity. Uh, scroll down. Any attempts to countermand these directives will be considered a direct violation of my religious beliefs as stated in front of witnesses and therefore in violation of my civil and human rights. Olivia Octavia B. Clark. Come sink your rig. Sanctified Pilgrim Church of Unitology. Witness. Witnesses. Huh. Just initials. Hmm. Okay, what else we got? Unexpected visitors. Returning rig sinks. G. Weller, PCSI, Officer Ishimura. Very Admin K. Daniels. Uh, McNeil, Murdoch, and Eckhart redacted by special order. Okay. Eckhart, huh? Access denied. This data is inaccessible under section 44-72. Uh, okay. Unexpected huh. visitors to where? K. Daniels, I. Clark, Hammond. Remove yeez users. So, the filter remove users. Asian. Interesting. Returning rigs. Oh, no. Filter remove user. She doesn't want to see us. She wants to see who else has been showing up. Oh, okay. <laughs> Negotiate. Oh, dear. <laughs> It worked. That sadistic son of a bitch, he really figured it out. Can you hear me? Can you understand me? Can you understand us? My god, why do you look like her? Why do you look like you? You're not her. This isn't... Just stop. Stop all of this. Do you understand? These creatures, all the death. I know you're responsible. What do you, what do you want to make it stop? She knew what was necessary. She offered everything she had for everything we could give. Do you want to know what she knew at the end? Bring the makers and we will make you both whole again. Makers? Who do you... You mean your creators? How the hell would I find them? They dug you out of the ground. 
God damn it, she's just make this stop. She's talking to the marker? Uh, yep. Those in. who create must seed convergence. She can't end what hasn't begun. Then she'll return what was taken. Return the marker to its place. Return the nexus to its sleep. If not the makers, then an architect will come. Time is patience when fate is inevitable. Return. So return the marker to the planet. That will stop this. But I can't... No, you need to end this now. Are you listening to me? Wait, where are you going? Octavia, come back. Octavia? Isaac's mother. Yep. yep. Creepy, right? Wait, that was... It was Octavia... Yeah, I, Octavia Clark. She yeah. was... T the marker was talking to her as Isaac's mother. Mm-hmm. Of negotiations. Oh, shit. Isaac, you're fine. Your rig. I swear to God, man. Shut up. No. No, Hammond, I will not. I'm busy reading my text messages. Uh, Working discreetly. Oh. Recording, do you? You lose language soon. So We've heard this before. Yeah. Come uh, your rig. That's that's those are all not found. Uh, there's so. more at the top though. Go back to the tutorial. And go. Oh no, it's just under. Yeah. No, that's that's it. So that's how you find out that they're basically there's the marker said you know bring it back yeah. to the planet because if not the maker then an architect will come. What the fuck is an architect? I yeah. don't know. All right, but next time on Character Select, we'll be playing a different game. But thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. And next time we're gonna play some kind of other game. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs>